Hey guys, I'm out at event 1013 again in Plano and my girl Riley is with me and we're here for the DFW CLC meeting. So it's gotta be the hotel because, the hotel. because Anya was so okay. Mm -hmm. Anya was the I am back home. I am cutting shelf lining stuff. Um, we used to call it contact paper, but now it's like this rubbery kind of grip ultra grip ultra shelf and drawer liner so what i do is i just kind of measure it out not exactly because i don't have time for that but i kind of measure it out and then just see um try to make it fit as good as possible in the area and then i put stuff on it so for example i'm trying to think where i have well, i'm gonna have shelf liner almost everywhere yet already so oh sorry <laughs> no do you want to see me okay so i have shelf liner here and of course i have the plates on there so inside like every drawer there's shelf liner underneath here and this is just a metal thing i got from bed bath and beyond and i'll link it all below <laughs> i'm just kidding um but if you guys want to know let me know so I am just trying to line all the shelves with all the contact ultra grip rubber paper strip stuff I have and get stuff put away because we're expecting furniture probably within the week and I'm gonna be out of town next week for half of the week. So I just don't want anything coming and then it'd be like, I don't know where anything goes. I want everything to be put away, ready for the furniture to come in and then I can place it when I get home. So like I, for example, have all of this, these cleaning products out. That's not where they go, because that should be clean. Except for, I think that's pretty much gonna be empty except for my KitchenAid mixer in the corner, because I don't really have a spot for the KitchenAid mixer, and it's heavy. So I don't anticipate moving that too much except when we have company over and we're gonna be doing baking or something, and then I'll move it to the main, my huge island. So I'm gonna be putting contact paper up at the top and then on this shelf as well. And then I'm gonna be putting all the bulk stuff like these kitchen trash bags. I'm gonna be putting those on the top shelf cause I'm not gonna to need to access those quite as much. And then I'll put some of these cleaning supplies in each of the bathrooms. Uh, not all of them, just like a Comet, a Windex or something or the Clorox wipes or whatever, just a couple things. So for quick cleanups and then I'll put the rest in that closet. So it'll be tucked away, tucked away, tucked away now. I keep singing that song. And I've got a stack of papers that I'm shredding because it has sensitive information on it and just never have the, like some stuff is from 2003, 2010. I even had the loan papers from when I bought the house, that other house in 97, I think it was. So yeah, no reason for me to hang on to that. No reason to just be like, hold it on for dear life to that paperwork. So I'm just gonna start shredding that. The rest of the stuff is gonna go into the regular recycle bin. And looks like the cat's trying to get inside here. So I'm wanting to get the house back in order so that when my furniture does come, I can just, I don't know, feel better about stuff. Like just feel like things are put away. Like I still have stuff to put away over there. Um, some stuff is gonna be sold or given away, but oh, my back is tired. So that's what we're doing right now. And I say we, socks is not really helping though. Are you? He's not really, he's not really helping. Ben. He's a super friendly cat. But anyway, that's that's what I'm doing now. I've been doing that for the last hour and a half-ish or so. And just trying to get things back together. So if you've ever moved, raise your hand, give this video a like, and tell me your experiences. Tell me what it was like. What are your top tips? Like if you were gonna give tips to someone about moving, what would they be? Comment below and let me know. So, Mr. Hart and I are going to go and get David and Jennifer a bottle of gin as a closing gift for their house that they just closed on. I don't know what he's doing. Oh, he must be parking there. Okay, whatever. I'll lock the door. Um, they like gin. Jen likes gin. Actually, I think it's David. But, uh, and I don't really know anything about gin, so I think we're gonna go to some sort of liquor store 
and get them a nice bottle. Maybe something artisan or crafts, craftsman bottle. I don't know. I don't know how you even say that. But we're going to go do that. And then we're going to go grab a bite to eat probably. And either bring it home or not. I am not sure. But I'll bring you along with us. We bought several types of gin. I did not film while we were inside of the um, liquor store. But now we're at Hobby Lobby because I need to get a gift basket to put all of the gins in. And then I bought these little tiny gins that I'm gonna just like stick all throughout the basket because that'll be super cute. It says tabletop decor is 50% off. But I don't know that it includes baskets, but we'll see. Yeah, it's, it's showing a sign, so hopefully all the baskets will be 50% off. See, it says 50% off, so everything should be. If not, I'll cuss them out when I get up there. I'm just kidding, I wouldn't cuss them out. But I'd go, mm, it says 50% off. <laughs> I need my 50% off. Thank you. But I don't know which one to get, but I need to make it fast because Marvin's hungry. And we're gonna go out and eat supper after this. So I'll just get a super cute basket and then we'll go and get some to eat. So Marvin helped me pick out and he's carrying the basket and the greenery, the green stuff, what do you call that? That the screen stuff that's what I'm going to use to build up the um, foam floral foam florist foam stuff anyway so I'm going to use that to build it up and then we'll just put that dessert foam. dessert foam yeah but we're hungry so that's probably why you're thinking dessert so we'll just put this in the bottom to kind of give it a base we'll put the alcohol on top and then we'll fill it in with the white we bought this, this stuff. We bought that. So, anyway, we'll be Gucci now. You got a bunch of that, huh? No, I don't. I get, I've <clears throat> used it all. Okay, so I think that's no. it for now. Well, that was a delish meal. I had the flautas, and then they had some sort of like avocado. Uh, I don't know what kind of like sauce or something it wasn't like I don't know what it was and then Marvin had the chicken breast Where are we? oh I got lost Marvin had the chicken breast and uh, we had rice and beans they had homemade tortillas and then we shared some chest lettuce cake for dessert and it was good I forgot to end yesterday's vlog. No, that's not becoming a habit, but it did happen. And I'm getting ready for church right now. We're about to leave and I had to get my earrings. The gray earrings, remember, that I couldn't find, but I really found, but anyway. So I'm gonna take those and put them on as we walk to church, because that's how close we live. And I'll start tomorrow to you, tomorrow's vlog, in a minute. Bye, y'all. See, I'm waving with one finger, because I got that. Bye, y'all.